Namaste and welcome to my classes. I come with some examples. Now look at the examples. Ram Kumar and Son, Karnataka, has made the following supply during the month of December to its customer. He is a common dealer. He is supplying to its customer. Look at this. Ground nut oil. If the ground nut is supply, it is exempted. But if it is oil, which is taxable at the rate of 5%. So it is taxable. Books. Now I mentioned which is, which is graph book or excise book. So it is exempted. Sanitary wares. It is taxable. Chocolates and sweets. Taxable. Food grain is exempted. Okay. Look at that. The supply is given, the food grain supply to flour mill, dealer, local taxes, whatever, it is exempted, not taxable because food grain is exempted. Now come to the additional information. Sanitary goods of Rs. 80,000 has been supplied to a dealer of Telangana. The Ram Kumar and Sant, the supplier situated in Karnataka, the destination of supply is Telangana. IGST is applicable for sanitary wear 80,000. Sanitary wear he supplied 3,20,000 out of which 80,000 is Telangana. It is an interest rate IGST for 80,000 only. Calculate taxable turnover value of GST. GST rate 6% each. Mention the each means CGST 6%, SGST 6% but IGST is 12%. Now come to the computation. Computation of taxable turnover and GST payable. Ground net oil which is taxable, books exempted, sanitary wear 80,000 Telangana but you have to take the total first. You have to analyze the taxable turnover of supply. He supplied 3,20,000 take it as it is. Chocolates and sweets, 90,000 food grains, which is exempted. The total taxable turnover is 6,60,000. Add calculation of GST. Taxable supply intra means within the state. Out of the 660, 80,000 is out of state. 660 minus 80, we will get 580,000 for within the state supply. So CGST, apply this value at the rate of 6% and SGST at the rate of 6%, you will get 69,600 of the total. Now, supply to Telangana, that is IGST applicable. Tax on outside supply, interest rate, 80,000. IGST, you have to take entire 12%. No need to divide this line. 80,000 into 12%, 9,600. Okay, add this both GST, you will get total GST, only this amount. This is taxable turnover and this is GST total payable amount. Okay. Taxable supply plus GST. In this, in a working note, you have to mention the textbooks, newspaper, magazines, slate, chalk, sticks and other are exempted from the tax. And food grain exempted supply, whether intrastate or interstate supply. You have to mention working note very clearly to analyze the problem. Now come to the another example. Rama Limited manufactured 500 fans. It is a manufacturing limited. During the month of December. 500 fan during the month of December. As price list mentioned is 7,000 per fan, 1,700 per fan is in a price list or you called as MRP and GST separately chargeable. In this term, the GST is separately chargeable where Rama Limited allowing the discount to wholesaler on this list price. The Rama Limited allowing the discount only for the wholesaler at the rate of 20%. Let's see what is the supply. During the month, fans sold to the wholesaler 285 fans. 
for the retailer 175 why 400 is unsold we no need to take any closing stock the gst is only on supply that is sales if no sales no gst now closing stock is no need to consider look at this wholesaler getting the discount retailer may not getting any discount come to the calculation gst will be 12 percent computation of taxable turnover and gst payable first you have to take supply of fans to the wholesaler is clearly mentioned that wholesaler wholesaler getting the 285 fans per unit is 1700 the discount is applicable at the rate of 20 percent so multiply this and you will get the total amount and less discount of 20 percent on the amount this is the amount and you will get the 20% 96,900 and you will get 387,600 on the overall amount. But you want to take the per unit calculation, you have to take this like 1,700 into 20% per unit discount is 340. Out of 1,700 minus per unit discount 340, you will get the 1,360 into 285 fans multiply with you will get the same amount 387,600 you can take any one of the method now this is the wholesaler is clear now come to the retailer retailer is getting the 175 fans so 175 no discounts 1700 only and multiply with and you will get the taxable value of supply now applicable rate of GST is 12%. So take it as CGST as GST at the rate of 66% and you will get the GST payable. In this calculation, you have to be very careful while calculating the discount. The discount is given to whom and at how much rate. Okay. Thank you.